Olympic runner Carrie Tellefson, and I can run a mile in less than four and a half minutes. How long do you think it takes for these apples to get to your lunch tray? This is my friend Farmer Bill, and can you tell me about the farm to fork path? Sure, Carrie. There's a lot of steps involved. You'd be surprised at how fast we can get an apple like this to the school. It takes a lot of work by a lot of people to grow, pick, and process apples and other foods like vegetables, meat, or poultry. Follow me on the farm to fork path. Most foods begin growing in spring and are harvested in summer. Apples are one of many foods grown here in Minnesota. They're picked, sorted, cleaned, packed up, and shipped out. They go from the farm to a distributor who takes them to your school for you to eat. Well, I think the most important thing is that we're getting the students a good apple. Farmer Bill says his apples get to our school in two days. But apples grown far away can take a week or more. And by throwing our cores into the compost, we send nutrients back to the soil, and our farm to fork path makes a full circle. The compost comes right back here to the farm, where we can help grow more healthy, smart food for next year.